when you work as an architectural designer or a construction management team, it's really important to know your manufacturer information. Most teams have preferred manufacturers uh, and suppliers, people that they've dealt with and they know they deliver the right product at the right time, at the right price. Um, but sometimes you have to look something up, something specified that you don't know what it is. And so this is a very simple um, project to allow you to do that. So so look at the, study the materials about non-competitive specs and things like that. You are hopefully working on one that uh, is competitive instead of non-competitive. In other words, you can go out and find the best deal that matches the requirements that you can find. And for Windows, uh, do a little web search. Three companies. I've given you two. You have to find another one. You can just say, you know, window manufacturers. And then in your workbook, you're going to do two things. You're going to list the manufacturer's names. I've given you two. Where you can buy their windows. That's called distribution. And a link to the company's site. Now, uh, often you can get um, windows direct from the manufacturer, but I'd like you to look for a local distribution site. It might be Home Depot. It might be Lowe's. It might be um, uh, a specific glass or window company. So let me show you how to do that. First thing I did um, was typed in the name Anderson. Okay, and it's actually a bigger name than that, but everybody goes by Anderson. It's actually Renewal by Anderson, something like that. They're trying to make their name more sustainable sounding. And then for the distribution sites, I typed in Anderson Window Distributors. And I came up with um, their actual company site, but then I saw that there were a bunch of them for... Um, for specific companies in our area. Here's uh, RBA Sacramento. Here's Northwest Exteriors. Uh, there's some more. Find a showroom here. Oh, you can get them at Home Depot. Uh, so there's all sorts of places that you can look. I chose this one because it's near the top, and that's why people like to have their name near the top when they're on Google. And you come over to here, and there it is. And, and you can take this, copy the URL, and let me just say, pretend that doesn't exist. You can highlight all of that, go up to the little link button way at the top, and I use Control-C and Control-V, put it in there. And now somebody can click on that, RBA. Sacramento. And I did the same thing for the manufacturer's site. Came over here. I like to right click and open in a new tab so I don't go over the top of mine. And here's, here it is. Okay, Renewal by Anderson. That's a, that's a company site that you can go to. Cool. And Anderson Glass, they're actually uh, a manufacturer, I believe they're in, um, in, um, gosh, right below, right below Red Bluff, right below Redding, and they do have work. They are always asking if we have somebody who wants to move up to that area and start working for them in their design and manufacturing facility up there. So this is a very cool, very cool company that's that's local. Um, but they do, they, they make their, win, their windows up there. So there you go. You can, you can do the same thing with that. Take that um, URL, copy it, and put in a link. And then do the same thing for Milgard and whichever the third one you find. And you can do the same thing for, um, for your doors. Okay, so... There you go. That's what we're looking at here. Of course, up here on 3.2.1, we've already done that. You've 
you've uh, made your Revit. Now we're looking more at, at where do we go to get those things. All right, there you go. There's 3.2.2, typical manufacturer information. And how do you find the manufacturer? And a local source.